And the image you are looking at is a model of a Nassaro head originally designed by artist John Nassaro. In the previous video I used it to draw a face using the Loomis method. And the Asaro head is another method of drawing heads but this focuses on the planes of the face which is much better than the Loomis method for finding your highlights and your shadows. Close observation will show that you have less detailed view on the left hand side and a more detailed view of the sculpted planes on the right hand side. The best way to learn from this head is to position it at an angle that you need, then draw out the planes on an overlay. You can then use the planes as drawn on the overlay to create your own freehand drawing of the face. Pay attention to the planes, but also to the proportions of the segments in relation to one another. The planes on their own might look messy, but you'll see the value of planes when you start dropping in color or shading. Understanding, practicing and adhering to the Saro planes will help you to create faces that have more volume and three-dimensionality. Just do a lot of them. <laughs> 